Harry Boys. I'm the Dean of Academic Affairs at Union Theological Seminary and also the Skinner and McAlpin Professor of Practical Theology. I'd like to tell you a little bit about an interest of mine, an interest in the relations between Christians and Jews. This is actually a very difficult and somewhat delicate topic to teach because the reality is that the history between Christians and Jews for nearly two millennia has been a history of rivalry, of conflict, and tragically, of hostility and violence. So sometimes I engage people in a very simple exercise when I have Jews and Christians together in the same class. And I give an exercise that involves how we talk about our shared scriptures, because the Hebrew Bible, or Tanakh to Jews, is what Christians call the Old Testament. So the First Testament is to the Second Testament as X is to Y. So sometimes, in fact, very often when I do this, for Christians, they'll say, well, the First Testament is to the Second as the moon is to the sun. That is, yes, we respect the Old Testament, but it's, it's nothing compared to the sunlight of the New Testament. And for Jews, this is a very odd thing to say because they did not realize that in the Christian mind, the New Testament totally trumps the Old Testament. So then we get involved with how do we as Christians, how do we interpret those texts? And why do we read them differently from Jews? And is it necessary that we read them differently from Jews? We're not looking, I just have to say as a teacher, I'm not looking for people to come to a consensus about this, but only to begin to understand that simply sharing texts does not mean that we look at them the same way, but knowledge of our sharing of them may open up new possibilities of how we read them.